kids, and today we're gonna learn about the wild animals. And today we also have two friends with us. We have the tiger, and we also have the camel. Alright, so let's start. So first let's start with our wild animal puzzle board. Okay, so let's pick our first animal. And the first animal that we're gonna pick, let's take this one. And let's turn around and who we have here. Do you know who it is? Do you know his name? Yes, it's a zebra. It starts with letter Z. Zebra. Great, and zebra has the black and white stripes, right? So, where we should place the zebra? Let's find a place for the zebra on this board. Let's try our first, maybe here. Could it go? No. If we're gonna turn around, no. So we can turn around the zebra, right? In every position. So maybe let's, let's try here. But if we're gonna turn around, and yes, red, it worked pretty well. So we found our first animal. Okay, let's continue with the next one. And let's pick this big puzzle, right? It's really big one and really heavy. So let's turn around and who we have here. Do you know who it is? Can you say it? Let's say on one, two, three. It's a mama elephant. Great, well done. And who we have here? It's a baby elephant. Great. So let's take this puzzle piece and let's find the place for it. So, you see that this is the small one, so we can place here or here or here or here, right? So there is only one place where we can place our elephants. So let's do it together and congratulations, we found second puzzle piece for our board. Great, we found two wild animals, one zebra, and two elephants great let's continue so the next puzzle piece that we're gonna take gonna be this one so let's take this one and turn around and who we have here can you see we have here with the two horns you see it's smiling who is that it's a rhino great and let's look where we can place our the rhino the animal so maybe we can try here no it doesn't work here so maybe we can turn around no so if we're gonna turn around maybe like this no but we need the image to be seen so we're gonna pick this one so the rhino goes like this and find the place great so the next one oh who we have here here we have mr pig helping us Okay, we're gonna listen to Mr. Big, and Mr. Big gonna help us to find that next animal. So, Mr. Big gonna choose. So, let's see. <sighs> Mr. Big is saying this one. And what we have here. <sighs> Mr. Big is saying that this is not animal, and Mr. Big is right. So, this is the tree. And the name for the tree is Savannah Tree. Great, so we're gonna take this one and place it right here amazing and mr pig is pretty excited about the next one so let's take the next one let's see where mr pig is going uh, uh, she's saying that we should take this one so let's turn around and who we have here oh we have a like a really big animal and who is that can you say mr pig mr pig is saying that this is the buffalo great so let's take our buffalo and let's find the place. Should we place it here? No. Should we place it here? Yes, we found another animal. We already found four animals. One, two, three, and four. And we also found savannah tree. So let's give the Mr. Big the try to find the next one. <laughs> okay, you... <laughs> This one, okay, let's take to this one, and who we have here? You know this animal, it's a king of the jungle. Who is that? 
It's a lion. Okay. And where we should place the lion? Let's find a place. Should we place it here? No. Let's maybe... In. Where the lion is going? The lion is going here. Great. We found the lion. The king of the jungle. Okay, let's find the next one. And let's listen to Mr. Big. Mr. Big is saying that this one. We should take this one. Okay, let's take animal and who we have here also it looks like a lion but this is the different animal it's called leopard and it starts with letter l leopard l trade so where the leopard is going oh, leopard is going to his place and yes great we found another animal okay so let's Maybe turn around this one. And who we have here? This called monkey. Okay, and where is the monkey going? Let's see where the monkey is going. M, monkey. Here's the place for the monkey. And yes, we found another animal, the wild one. So we only left with the lost animal. And let's turn around and who we have here? With a long neck. You see, it's a really long neck. Okay. It's called... Giraffe. Great. We found the giraffe. So we're gonna take this giraffe and place it in our board. And where we should place it our board? Can you say to me where I should place this? Yes, you're right. I should place it here. Good job. So let's place our giraffe here. Great. Amazing. And we completed our puzzle with the help of Mr. B. Okay, great. So we've completed our first puzzle. So let's continue with the next one. So the next one gonna be the cubes, right? So who we have, who, who we need to find here is the tiger. Okay, and Mr. B gonna help us. So Mr. B is saying that the first step that we should do is to turn around all the puzzle pieces and try to see if there is the tiger so is here is the tiger right so we're gonna place it here so the next one is this a tiger can you see yes it's a tiger it's a tiger okay let's place it here so the next one let's turn around and see if we we need to look for the tiger let's turn around and Yes, here is the tiger. Another puzzle piece we already found free. So the next one, let's turn around and see if there is the tiger. Let's turn around the... Oh, who is that? It's a tail of the tiger. Great. So we found four puzzle pieces. Let's turn around and see if there is the tiger. And... Hmm. Let's ask Mr. Pig. Mr. Pig, what do you think? Is this a tiger? Uh, uh, uh. Yes, Mr. Pig is saying that this is the hand of the tiger and the ear. Okay, we're gonna take this to our puzzle piece. And then the next one. Let's give to Mr. Pig to see which one. He's saying this one. We should think this one. Okay, let's do it. Turn around and see if there is the tiger. Let's turn around. <laughs> It seems to be there is no tiger. What do you think, Mr. Pig? Mr. Pig is saying that there is no tiger, but he's saying that here is the apples, right? And here we have apples. So it seems to be that this is from the tiger puzzle piece. Great. Okay, the next one. Let's turn around and see if there is the tiger. And if we don't know if it's a tiger or not, we're going to ask Mr. Pig. Mr. Pig, where's the tiger? Mr. Pig is saying that we should turn around and... Uh, yes, here is the tiger. Great. Let's place and then the next one. Who we have here? Here we need again to find a tiger. Let's look for the tiger. T, tiger. Great. And Mr. Pig is saying that this is the tiger. Amazing. So we only have last piece that we need to turn around. And let's look who we have here. The tiger, right? We need a tiger. <laughs> Mr. Big, what do you think? 
Mr. Beak is saying that this part of piece is tiger because this one is the small part of the tiger ear. Okay, let's trust Mr. Beak and place it here. Right and right now, uh, Mr. Beak is saying that we should combine them. So we should start with what, Mr. Beak? Uh, uh, we should start with face. So here's the face of the tiger, right? So here is two puzzle pieces that we're gonna connect. Then we're gonna continue with the mouth. So this and this together. Great, we have a face of the tiger. Uh, and Mr. Big is saying that we should continue with the tail of the tiger. So we're gonna take the tail. And here we have the tail. And here we have another part of the tiger. Great, it looks really good. So then we need, so here we have apples. You see the red apple, and here we have red apples. So we're gonna combine them together like this. Amazing. And then we have a small part of the head of the tiger. And great. And here is another part of the tiger. Remember the Mr. Big said that said this to us. The small part of the ear. Thank you, Mr. Big. And well done. We've completed the tiger puzzle. Amazing. This is another wild animal. So let's continue with the next one. Thank you, Mr. Big. So the next one gonna be... The camel, okay. So, and Mr. Peak again. Let's listen to Mr. Peak. Mr. Peak is saying to us that we should turn around them and trying to find the camel first before we start to combine them. So let's try to find the camel. <laughs> Mr. Peak, is this a camel? Yes, so here's our first puzzle piece of the camel. Great. So let's turn around and if we need help, I'm gonna ask Mr. Peak. This seems to me like another puzzle piece for the camel. And let's try to connect like this. Great! We've combined our first puzzle pieces. So, let's again turn around and see for the camel. Okay, let's look for the camel. <laughs> let's ask Mr. Big. Mr. Big, is this a camel? Uh, uh, yes, Mr. Big is saying that this is the camel. So we're gonna place it here. Okay, let's do the next one and try to find the camel right camel C camel okay where it could be <laughs> mr big let's ask the mr big mr big what do you think and uh, mr big is saying it we should take this one try it okay let's take this one and place it here at the moment great so the next one let's take this puzzle piece and, Mr. Big, what do you think of this one? It seems to me like a yellow sand that what we need. <laughs> yes, Mr. Big is saying yes, so let's place it here. And then take another one. And rotate. And if there is the camel, let me know. Right? Say yes if you see the camel. Yes, here is the camel. Good job, we found another puzzle piece. So then let's take this one and rotate and see if there is the camel. Huh? Mr. Big, is this a legs of the camel? Uh, uh, great! Let's take this here. So the next one, let's rotate and see if there is the camel. If there is the camel, uh, uh, yes, this is the camel. Okay. So then let's try to find here if there is the camel. Seems to me Let's turn around again and see if there is the camel. Mr. Big, can you help us? <laughs> Mr. Big saying to rotate this side. Okay, yes. Mr. Big, yes, he's saying that this could be the camel. Okay, nice. We found all the puzzle pieces for the camel. Great, and Mr. Big gonna help us this time. So Mr. Big is gonna combine the face like this. Great, <laughs> thank you, Mr. Big. And then Mr. B gonna take this part, right? So this one, and then... Ah, yes, great! Amazing! So we almost have three puzzle pieces combined. So the next one, Mr. B is saying, we should take the legs. Thank you, Mr. B. Amazing! And the next one could be the tail, right? Amazing! So we are moving really fast you're doing so well 
so let's take this one. And Mr. Peek is saying that this could be the another puzzle piece that could help us. Could help us to combine those puzzles. So let's help Mr. Peek and great, amazing. So then the next one, Mr. Peek is saying that with this we should take. Okay, let's take and help Mr. Big, and yes! Thank you, Mr. Big. <laughs> Amazing. So we have left with two puzzle pieces. So Mr. Big is saying we should take this one and... Uh, what did it say, Mr. Big? Mr. Big is saying that we should turn around like this. <laughs> yes, and then... Great! Thank you, Mr. Big. Thank you very much. Great, thank you. Okay, so we have the last puzzle piece. This one. Right, Mr. Big? Uh, yes. So let's turn around. And should we do like this? Uh, uh, Mr. Big is saying no. We should turn around and place it this way. Yes, Mr. Big. What do you think? Uh, let's try this. Let's try that. And then... Okay, let's do this. Seems like great. Uh... Yes, Mr. Peek is saying yes. Amazing. Okay, so we completed our camel puzzle. So here we have a camel in the sand, right? Thank you, Mr. Peek. Thank you. So we completed the camel puzzle, right? We've completed the tiger puzzle, right? So we've completed two puzzles. And we also learned about the wild animals. Great. So we've completed one by one, and you've done this amazing and great. See you in the next video. Thank you, Mr. Pig. <laughs> Thank you, kids. Bye. See you next time. Don't forget to subscribe.